Okay, in continuation of my work on my Rock Island uh, stainless 1911, on uh, a past video I threw on a new mag release, an extended one, uh, that is a lot better looking, I believe so. <laughs> uh, and today I'm going to kind of go over the uh, Wilson Combat hex head grip screws. So um, really not much to say about this one. Um, really just got to go ahead and take out these on each side and pop these new ones in. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and pop these off and I'll be right back with the new ones in and I'll just say a few things and that's about it. I'll be right back. Alrighty, so I have these installed as you can see and I left the other side the factory. Um, I do like the traditional uh, screw in ones but the only thing with these are over time if you take them off uh, it's easy to mess these up especially if you don't have the right size screwdriver. Uh, I just really wanted to throw these hex on. Uh, I think Pretty much every other 1911 I have uses them. Less chance of stripping them out. Um, and in terms of looks, uh, you know, they're nothing like super classy or anything, uh, but they do make it look very nice. Uh, a little bit more modern per se. Um, but yeah, so I don't know. I mean, know what you guys think. Grip screws are one of them things where everybody could take it or leave it. These aren't really overly decorative i would say uh some people really have some nice looking stuff uh if you really want to go that route but uh, one thing i did forget to mention is in the little kit it does come with the correct allen key size that you need uh, which is handy because uh you know a lot of 1911s are using these uh, like on my bbr here which comes stock with these uh and factory size they fit so um, not bad um, and they you know like I said they they fit nice uh, and the other thing uh, you know what might drive some people insane depending on how much of a how anal you are you know sometimes the orientation of these will rotate out uh, you can make them the same like uh, like that but they will rotate through a vibration uh, with an Allen key one, uh, it'll always be the same. So just obviously you can see that they rotate out. They're going to look the same no matter what. So that is another thing. It's more of an aesthetic uh, feature more than anything. But it is another little thing uh, in why you would want something different. Um, what am I going to do with these ones? I'm going to keep them as spare parts because you never know if you lose anything. Uh, and as much as I'm throwing different parts here and there uh, and different guns, um, I'm starting to get a collection. So it's always good to have backup parts. And, uh, you know, so yeah, uh, let me know what you guys think. And uh, thanks for watching.